Hello, my name is Dylan Panko. Welcome to Mendocino National Forest, one of my favorite places to go play. Right now, we're in the Game Preserve near Lake Pillsbury. I'm doing an introductory video to let you know who I am and what this is kind of all about. So I'm basically just a guy with some cameras, a little bit of gear, and Premiere Pro. Uh, I'm still learning, going through the process of figuring out how to use all this stuff, but having a wonderful time doing it. And while I'm doing it, you get to see some cool places that you can't find on the map. Some of the videos I've done just recently, I didn't even know we were there until I'd actually met with a ranger and showed me, he showed me on a map. One of the locations, Keller Lake, is literally like, if you took a ballpoint pen and stab, or not stab, but just dotted the paper, it's just that small. But when you get there, it's so beautiful. So I want to make that easier for you by making it so you can find these places on my channel here and then go, okay, that's a good one. Oh, I don't like that one then, but you can sort through them and find what you like and then actually have some idea what you're getting into when you're there. I love spending time outdoors. Uh, Mendocino National Forest for me is not a long drive, so I come out here all the time. Not everybody knows how abundant camping is out here and that it's, there's no campground, so you don't have the campground keys. Not everybody knows that you can come out here and find these little spots with fire rings, these little turnoffs, and just set up camp. It is completely legal and some of the best camping you'll ever find. The hard part with some of these is that they don't show up on maps. So the only way to find them is by driving and exploring or by watching a YouTube channel where someone's launching videos and showing you how to get there. I do my best to mark every location with GPS coordinates. This is what I found, whether I like it or not uh, is irrelevant. What I'm gonna do is just try and give you my thoughts and my opinions uh, and let you decide if you like it or not. And if you wanna come here, if you find these videos interesting and helpful, I'm asking you please subscribe, like, and share. I do all of this on my own time and my own dime. I have no sponsors. We're not, this mic, that camera, the gear I'm using at home to edit the video, all out of my own pocket. Most people don't even know that this is out here, exists. You're welcome to come out here and you're welcome to stay here. Most people think that KOA is the only place to go or a state campground is the only place to go. No, those are not the only places to go. Those are the only places to go if you want a pit toilet, power, running water, sure. But if you don't mind hauling your own water and bringing your own tent and, and like this spot, not having a picnic table, these are fantastic. Not only that, your neighbor's not right there and right there and right there and right there. Uh, I haven't, I've been here for two and a half days. I have yet to see another car except the people that I'm with. I come out here to get away from people because I don't want to bother them and I don't want them to bother me. There are times when I'm cooking dinner and I might want to hear, put on Pandora and hear some music while I'm cooking dinner, but I don't want to disturb the guy that's 10 feet away from me. That wouldn't fly. And I don't want him to be playing his rap music or punk rock while I'm trying to take a nap. So coming out here to me is a better solution. It's not that much further of a drive. There's lots of places you can get to without having to have some fancy vehicle with lift and all this stuff. There's no reason why not to. So let me show you around, subscribe. Let's sh let me be your tour guide, if you will. I make myself more than available. If you want to write me and ask me more specific questions about any location, please feel free to. Please subscribe, like, share these videos. Let's share this wilderness with the world. Uh, no, that's not right. And show even more places, introduce more places. So what I'm trying to do is show that, show some of the abundance.